It was just a 1-0 tightly contested victory for the Hornets when these two met a year ago. The only goal coming off a set piece in the first half and goals few and far between once again. The opportunities would favor Nazareth in the first half and a majority off the cross from Parker Hoff. This one finds the foot of Romea Meza Corda, but he sends it wide right to keep us scoreless at the break. Flipping the switch in the second was Emmaus. Hornets finding success from the flanks. Blaze Verastro finding the head of Ryan Kiernan, but it's a spectacular save by Kevin Gonyard denying the Hornets the score. And they would continue to find ways to get to net after another dangerous opportunity. Ty Summer with a one-on-one, -on -one, but yet another stop from the senior in goal. Those enough to force a 10-minute overtime. The best chance once again off a cross looking for Kiernan. That slips through Gonier's hands, but a terrific defensive stand will again keep us notched at zero. So to another OT we go. Hornets with five corners during overtime. Another that nearly finds the back of the net, but it's Sebastian Puente with the goal line stand. Corner after corner, but denied. That is until the waning seconds of this one. Callum Harvey on the service and Owen Moyer on the connection. He heads that one down and it bounces into the bottom left-hand corner. The golden goal, just his second goal of this season. But the senior forward, the hero in this one, as Emmaus takes it in yet another OT thriller, defeating Nazareth by a 1-0 final. So coming into the game, we knew that Nazareth was a team to, the team to beat. And uh, we played some teams last week, kind of 1-0 victories, and we knew that we had to win this game. And we came out here and we fought hard and ended up putting one in the back of the net and celebratory win. If at first you don't succeed, try, try again, which is exactly what Emmaus had to do, utilizing different players in different roles until that game winning connection and for John Kerry it all came down to persistence. I'm proud of our effort. I think that's the most important thing that we didn't quit. 47 seconds left after a second overtime to, to find it just showed a lot of heart and I'm really proud of that. It was a very even game. Uh, hard fought. They, I think they mirror us in a lot of ways. The way they play, the way they look, their, their, their shape. A lot of things are like us. So I, I, to find that after players were dropping left and right with cramping, I'm, I'm proud that we were able to, to dig one out. It was good. They, they all work hard in the corners and we've been working on them in practice. It's good to see it finally pay off. Yeah, I think it means, like you said, persistent. I think we all worked hard. We all dug in. It was a, it was a slow start, but after that, we kind of kicked into the high gear. Yeah. I think we just needed to come out here and prove ourselves to the rest of the division, and we ended up doing that. So it was a really good day. On the scene in Emmaus, I'm Cassie Schmidt reporting for the SC Network.